Hello, I'm from the Australian Government. Have you noticed how we make everything good shit? One by one, we're taking the things you know and love. Medicare. TAFE. The ABC. ARC. The National Archives. Public schools. Handshakes. Desks. And turning them into conduits for our shit fuckery. That's because we, we make, make everything, everything good, good shit. In today's episode of Make Everything Good Shit, we look at the CSIRO, your trusted science agency, which has earned a reputation for great inventions. Wi-Fi. Space stuff. AeroGuard. Unlike gas companies, Companies which have earned a reputation for poisoning aquifers, ripping you off with high bills and paying no fucking tax. So we thought, hey, what if we could let those gas companies use the CSIRO brand to regain your trust and keep making the ching-ching? Introducing Jazera. Jazera is an alliance between your beloved CSIRO and the five biggest cunts, I mean companies, in Australia's fracking industry. It's a great setup. They provide the money and the CSIRO provides the logo. Those gas companies are very modest, so whenever Jazera publishes its research, they give CSIRO all the credit. No need to mention them. Of course, CSIRO scientists care deeply about their integrity. But don't worry, Jazera fixed that problem by putting gas executives on all the committees that oversee its research. And just to be sure, we also cut hundreds of CSIRO climate scientists' jobs and made the rest fear for their jobs if they speak out. We, we make, make everything, everything good shit. Jazera has made some terrific findings. Like that time they said this river being on fire is totes normal and has nothing to do with the thousands of fracking wells all around it. Turns out it does. Or that time Jazera found our fracking emits less than the US. Sure, gas companies told it which wells to study. And sure, it only measured the well pads, ignoring all the other infrastructure and pipelines. But let's not get caught up in the details. And of course, that time Jazera discovered fracking is safe for the environment by testing six out of Queensland's 19,000 gas, gas wells. wells. Sure, those six wells were chosen by Origin, who were so thoughtful they even paid for the tests. But that was good enough for us. Us. So now we can tell you the, the CSIRO, CSIRO says, fracking says fracking is safe, safe for the, for the environment. environment. And that's how we've been letting your trusted science agency be infiltrated and hollowed out by these earth fucking tumours. But don't worry, you still have your trusted Bureau of Meteorology. Hello, I'm from The Bomb. And today's forecast is brought to you by our sponsors, who gave us millions to not mention climate change. We, we make, make everything good shit. shit. In New South Wales, expect Santos to fuck the beautiful Pilliga Forest. With a high chance, it'll also take a shit on surrounding farmlands unless you lock the gate. All approved as safe thanks to research by Jazeera. Moving to the NT, watch out for this new piece of shit on the block run by Liberal Party donors, which is ready to frack the outback now that the moratorium has been lifted, thanks to research by Jazeera. Speaking of moratoriums, Victoria's just lifted theirs, so watch out for gas companies lining up to drill the Great Ocean Road, unless you tell them to fuck off, which is how you saved Crib Point from AGL. You know, the wankers who'll sue you if you use their logo to expose how they're Australia's biggest climate polluter. And in WA, if allowed to proceed, this flaming shit comet will wipe out not just our climate targets, but also the Murujuga rock art, home to the oldest known depiction of the human face. How appropriate. We'd like to warn you that all this will lead to more extreme weather events, droughts, floods, and hotter, more frequent bushfires. But the very same guy who founded Jazeera and turned your CSIRO into a cheer squad for gas companies is now our boss. And he loves to remove all mention of climate from our public statements. Please send help. Back over to you at Bullshit HQ. Thank you, Bomb. What's that? How can we let your most trusted and beloved agencies be infiltrated and corrupted by these soulless fucking parasites? Oh, sweetie, that's what happens when your government's been captured by the fossil fuel industry. Join us next week for another episode of Make Everything Good Shit as we take a look at universities, the NDIS, and your life in general. Authorised by the Department for the Gas Lead Shit Fuckery. 